This is Sway. 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 In the morning. In the morning. In the morning. Shake your body. Wake your fuck ass up. That crust out your eyes. What can I do? You put me in a box. You're only happy in a box. What's next? A coffin? That's a clip from Houdini, which is a biopic, two, a two-night miniseries airing on the History Channel September the 1st, starring my homie right here. You know him from Summer of Sam, The Jacket, Cadillac Records, played opposite Beyonce. Mm. Oh, yeah, yeah, Damn, yeah. that was fun. That was a great... Um, <laughs> that was a come up. <laughs> get it. Oh, man. Yeah, man. And she was really, she, I thought she did really well in her Eddie James great, role, right? right? Wow. Um, the Village, of course, King Kong, one of my favorite, you know, movies, you know, from the original days to now. Predators. Um, mm -hmm. And now Houdini, the one and only Adrian Brody hey. is here. Woo! Yo, did you Thank make you. out with, um, did you make out with Halle Berry? Yeah, man, in front of in front of the world. <laughs> I was like, man, if there's ever gonna be a chance to do this and and get away with it, <laughs> I'm up there, you know. Damn, you one of us, but, man. It's like you grew up in East Oakland with me. Well, yeah, you know what I'm saying. I mean, I I, I kind of did grow up a little in in uh, in the Bay. I mean, I didn't grow up in the Bay like physically. I grew up in Queens, but um, uh -huh. my whole understanding that I can make beats and make music yeah. came from. Uh, an MC producer that I knew uh, from Oakland, and and like I remember I was seeing a show with Dell, and like I, I I did like a beatbox competition. I was I was young, but I did a movie out there when I was twenty. Uh huh. And uh, you did a beatbox competition? Yeah, I got up and and yeah, a battle battle somebody. But I ain't gonna don't ask me to no, battle no, 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 beatbox no, right no, now, man. man. No, this is it. <laughs> no, I'm not, no, no, I'm no, not. no, hold up, hold up. Play nah, nah, nah. the music down. <laughs> Come on, man. You don't sway in the morning, Adrian. Come hey, on, man. man. Let me, hear, let me hear what your yeah, beatbox sounded some, back then. Oh man, come on, man! Just a I need, bit, I need to what you in, need? imbibe, and then we can we can okay, all get all right. live. We'll come back we get to live. It. We'll come back to it. But all right. um, all right. but anyhow, man, you know, it's like I um. So the babe, I grew up. I grew up like I grew up like a real hip hop head as a kid, which is funny, and it's really it's it's interesting because I've I've thrown a lot of people off yeah. because the world's introduction to me, not people who knew me in, in New York or people who kind of saw Summer of Sam and these things, but the world's introduction came from The Pianist and from, you know, fortunately, the success of that film. Yeah. Yeah. And, you know, it's very serious stuff, and I had to represent all that. And so you got to kind of, like, put some of that edge, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know, you keep that. You keep and, that. And... It, it really shocked people like you know people would be like Yo, you make beats or you like you rap like they couldn't <laughs> even understand like the the concept of making music as a difference of like yeah <laughs> it's just so funny and it's so in today's day and age like that it's a foreign concept or that there's not like some universal thing and growing up in new york like it's so random to people and that they are limited in their perception of me or what i'm capable of or what i'm authentically um feeling yeah mm. But you know, now that you're saying it, you know, and people hearing this story, they could uh, make the tie. Um, I don't find it unusual. Um, my first introduction to you was on the big screen. But when they said, matter of fact, I think I saw you when you were here last time. And you I tried to get in. I was like, to, yeah. damn, I would really like to do your show, man. Yeah. I, like, I want to really get in there. I mean, I, yeah. I listen to you guys. I'm like, damn. They got me over there talking about my movie yeah, and being yeah. responsible. I'm like, I want to get in the studio. Yeah. I want to play him some music. Yeah. Adrian Brody is a citizen of Sway in the Morning. Hey, man. Uh, all right. Um, you talk about Dell. We got Souls of Mischief over here. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, wow, man. That's crazy, right? That's this is great. hip hop. Who right. are some of the, uh, like, who are like any producers? You know, you, when you think of DJ Premier, or RZA, I was going to say Premier. Okay. Pr RZA, I mean, I, I love RZA, and, and Wu Tang was a you know, big part of my, my early, you know, my zone, yeah. you know, but, um, you know, Primo was probably the epitome of what I, what represented, um, the, the, the austerity in the music yeah. that is the gift of a dope producer, which is the, sim and Dre too, yeah. you know, and like the simplest knock and just a real simple drum program and a, and a few sounds that are just right that twist you and then inspire you yeah turn you into a rapper you yeah. know premiere <laughs> i mean uh -huh. 
old gangstar shit would you, you know it just is amazing amazing and, right you know i mean i grew up mob deep and you know there are a lot of dope there are a lot of dope producers and, and today there's a lot of technology like i was going to show you i brought my ipad i got like okay. a i got an app for i made a beat for you here by the way you made a beat it's called okay. sway so i got a i got a, <laughs> got a sway beat yeah beat sway not oh, it beat is nine, sway but Yo, damn okay. but um you know this this is a perfect example of like what Oh, cool! We could plug right in, dude. That's so right dope. We live, um, right, right here with you, man. But that's dope. Um, Damn, Adrian Brody. First of all, pulling out his iPad, <laughs> he, he got beats all lined up. What, what's in between my? This is called Beatmaker Two. It's dope. Okay. They, they should give me something for that. But um, <laughs> <laughs> but it's twenty bucks, and like you know, I used to go. I mean, I'm, I, when I saw so when I started making beats, I I hung with these kids and my boy Adrian out there, who's mm -hmm. you know, um, you know, fly, really fly producer, and he he rapped and. Uh, He's got a whole crew out there, but um, he um, he uh, he schooled me to some gear, and I so I went home. I, I was I just moved to L.A. I was broke, and uh, I didn't know anybody. I was from Queens. I moved to L.A. I had done I'd studied acting for years, and I'd done like one film. I did a movie, um, Steven Soderbergh movie, at nineteen, and mm -hmm. bounced to L.A. and it wasn't even out yet. And I lived in a three hundred seventy five dollar a month apartment. Wow. Furnished, uh huh. Furnished, <laughs> including roaches, <laughs> and you know, man, and um, and uh, so I came. I did. I did this film in the Bay, and I came back, and I I went and I got the recycler, which is like you know the Craigslist of the era. Yeah. Before yeah. there was a Craigslist, you know, uh -huh. you know, and I and I bought. I went to some dude's house, and I bought a used EPS sixteen plus, which I know uh -huh. he was like. A plus, you want to so talk about making, that, man? I've been making beat on an EP. I, I had an EPS 16, then an EPS 16 plus, and then an ASR. I had a number of ASR 10s, and like you know. But I've been making beats since since then, and I have a track. I, ha well, I gave you a track that's from 1999. We by got, the way, we got it. You want which to is which is on a hold up. That's a battery operated. That's like the the version of this uh -huh. from 99 or whatever, which was like some Yamaha QI70 shit, which was like yeah, six right. AA batteries. <laughs> yeah. And I was making beats with my boy driving to the bay in his Cadillac and I almost crashed, like making a beat as I'm driving Damn. with two speakers stuck up in the headrest. <laughs> like that's how obsessed we were. And um, Yo, you ever use those machines, A+, plus? what do you all, use? Huh? All of the machines that he mentioned, I've owned. I still own uh, um. Uh, uh, the QI, the little small the QI joint, the, the, uh, yeah. the Yamaha I have a, joint. Yeah, I, I started on the 16, uh, 16 and then went to 16 plus and ASR man. 10, so. My man. He, he legit, with yeah, it. Yeah, he man. legit, right? <laughs> yeah. And it's like, I talked to RZA, I talked to RZA like kind of lately and I'm like, and he still uses an ASR and shit sometimes. I'm like, wow, man, I, I gotta go dig up my ASR. I mean, I know where it is, it's just, I'm, I'm a nomad, you know, I'm on the road constantly and, and, <laughs> this shit is heavy. I brought that to Jamaica. I brought my ASR to Jamaica and it rusted the screws on the back. <laughs> and I was like making beats and I made this sick track and there was a power outage and I lost that beat. You know how the ASRs used to crash all the time? That's I stopped it. But the fucking lightning storm and my shit crashed when I was like having the, you know, epiphany. I was like, that's the joint right there. That's the joint. Oh. And it was like, shh, 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 and the lights went out and, shh, and the oh. shit was gone. But um, so I used to travel. I used to travel heavy, but like I'm, you know, I, I, I paid dues with that that ASR. Yeah, it is. Hey, man, hold up. <laughs> That's his story, man. Adrian Brody, man. I like that. See, I wanted to talk to you about your investment and dedication to the culture. So we all, you know, oh, whenever man. some when people don't know, they kind of look at you side eye, like, "What is he doing, man? Is this real?" But I not think in New York. Not in New yeah, York. Yeah. And and it's funny, you know. You know, t th times have changed also, but you know when. Fucking Queens in the early '80s, yeah. and, and you know, LL Run DMC. It's different. Well, first of all, you know, there was KRS yeah. shitting on Queens. You know, yeah, it was like, yeah. and I love KRS, but like, you know, it was hard. It was hard, first of all, with a name like Adrian when Rocky came out. Yep, oh, yeah. Adrian. <laughs> yeah, that was it was hard being like a hip hop head because I had to like prove it to kids that were real who I were down, I was down with, but also the haters in my neighborhood who I was not down with, who yeah. were like rock and roll nothing against rock and roll but there was a real kind of disco rock and roll yeah. hated on hip hop at that time hip hop was like <laughs> it was hard it was outcast you, it was you were the outcast yeah, yeah. for sure and i yeah. and i can i maybe that's part of what i i, I vibe with and yeah. I, I vibe with that with the roles that i play i like to play characters that are that are not you know 
mm-hmm. typically, um, you know, Hollywood uh, Hollywood's version of a human being. Yeah, I think we're all complex, you know, and mm-hmm. and we're flawed, and we, you know, I respond to flaws. I respond to people triumphing over adversity, and that's what that's what hip hop is. You yeah. know, is hip hop is a language of representing yourself and overcoming the obstacles around you of the hood of the social constraints of racism of oppression and that's you know that's that's what houdini represents yeah. i swear to god yeah. houdini houdini represents not only uh escaping the confines of the chains and the shackles in a physical sense yeah he was p- broke poor uh European immigrant came to America and he overcame all of that and represented all of that to the working, working class and um, through perseverance and, you know, took a lot of knocks, he kept making it through and kept, kept overcoming obstacles and the dude was a locksmith, right? Yeah. He worked in a trade. His father was broke. Uh, they, they came to America. They had nothing. He was a locksmith by trade. Homeboy figured out I'm gonna. He he was struggling as a ma- magician. He said, "I'm gonna become an escape artist because he knew how to articulate locks and get out of locks." And yeah. so he didn't become a criminal. He said, "I'm gonna turn this into like <laughs> uh, a unique thing." He coined the term escape artist, and then he taught himself how to manipulate locks with his toes. Mm. Wow! Because he worked as like a on the side of a like freak show side of a circus, yeah. and was like around with these cats who didn't have arms and who had to like teach themselves. And he's like. That's dope. So then he like had his hands cuffed and everything. All of a sudden, he could manipulate himself, and that's Damn, inspirational. Damn, and I like that's that, really man. inspirational. I never looked at because I, I love like I illusionists like and magicians. And uh, Adrian Brody is here He's talking about Houdini, which is a, a, a mini series that's going to air on the History Channel starting September first. Man, I want to come back and play some of these beats and see if we can get Souls of Mischief. Oh, man. They just said, I'm a fan of his. I oh, hope his man. beats aren't whack. No. Um, <laughs> they ain't going to be whack. I ain't going to get, I ain't going to get up here fucking 30, 25 years later after making beats and play some whack shit. But I did, I, I brought some, I brought some, I make a lot of music, uh-huh. you know, just to clarify, you know, but I make a lot of, I'm, I'm, uh, I brought some, I brought some like hip hop shit that I like that I made. But these are, unfortunately, these are, most of these are, m- probably eight years old okay. or not. And I play you the one I made you yesterday just okay. to give you a vibe, just of like some shit that I'm just fucking okay, with let's do on that. this. All right. But you know, I don't have I don't have these loaded up on my 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 um well, my we... iPad and so I just forward these these things off my off my iPhone to uh so, so what do we have right here? You got some you got some cool tracks, but they're these are like done on a on um on a Triton uh-huh. And one one of these is on an ASR, but these aren't what I work with now, and they're not with like the current technology. It's not run through Pro Tools. It's not uh-huh. mixed. Uh-huh. It's just shit that was I had that I thought would be cool. But they but they they're me. They're you. They're, they're me, and they're they're grimy kind of <laughs> dark beats that I made. Okay, you know. let's do this. We're gonna come back. Give me ninety three <laughs> till, and then um uh and then we'll see if uh, souls. Yeah. You know these these dudes right here, man, are the epitome of they MCs. They might like this shit. No doubt. Oh, you know we're gonna man. come back and play it though, oh, yeah, and then right. open up the phone lines eight 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 seven four two three three four five. You want to talk with Adrian Brody? Give us a call right now. Sway in the morning. This is how we chill from ninety three till Souls of Mischief are here, ladies and gentlemen, in the studio with us. We're talking to Adrian Brody. You know him as an actor. We know him as a beat maker. <laughs> when he comes to Sway in yeah. the morning, he's a producer. Hell yeah. He's a beat maker. That's right. And we're going to hear some of your beats, hey, man. Hey, that's crazy because like for a long time, I was I was kind of embarrassed to say I was an actor, not because um, not because I didn't have something to show, but yeah. I didn't want to get into that conversation with people, you know, like yeah. I didn't really want to start like going through my, my credits. Yeah. And, um, and and when I moved to L.A., everybody was an actor. Yeah. You know, they were, there's unfortunately a lot of people. There's a lot of creative people, you know, in the music industry, too, man. I mean, that, that's, the other, that's the other crazy thing is, you know, making music and how, how um, hard it is to motivate yourself to do something. And I know a lot of cats that are super talented yeah. and they got it, but then they can't make it happen, mm-hmm. you know. And, and that, 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 there's a similar thing for actors. And but anyway, I used to say I make beats. Yeah, you know, so people be like, "Oh, so what do you do?" I said, "I make beats." You know, and 
Oh, you know. <laughs> so just, <laughs> now just the, switch the it's topic. Come, it comes <laughs> full circle, though. Yeah, man. You know, man, I got a surprise for you, man. One of the, you said one of your favorite producers of all time was Primo. We got Primo on the line with us right Get now. Get out of DJ here, DJ Premier. Primo, Premier, what up, my man? Hey, Adrian, what up? Man? What up, homie? How you been? <laughs> Me and Adrian met uh, actually at the. MTV Awards out in, in Europe a long time ago, and he was walking by. No, actually, we were, first it was we were at, I was at a Golden Globes party with Christina Aguilera, and uh, Tom Cruise walks in, and I'm like, hey, you know, for me being a hip hop dude, I'm more you know used to sit, being around MCs and DJs, yeah. so you know you see Tom Cruise, I'm like, wow, look at Tom Cruise right in front of me, he shook my hand, and then all of a sudden Adrian walks by, I'm like, oh shit, there go Adrian Brody, and which was more. Uh, uh, of of an excitement to me, wow, you know, my man. Even, though, even though Tom Cruise is an incredible actor, and I love his work, but it's just different because you're just a different different you know lane. And yeah. so when you walk by, we you know we kind of locked eyes, and you go, and you said Primo, you didn't say Premier. Yeah. So when you say Primo, Yo. that's like a lot more Yo. Uh, of a thing. Prim, I mean? check this. I'm I'm here doing press for my movie um, for Houdini coming out. I'm walking down the street. I'm rocking like old school, like my beat, but like a like a like a, a radio on my shoulder, like a boombox. I got my I, I got my iPhone playing all for the cash, loud and like walking past people, just loud on my right ear. Like yeah. what? Like I swear to God, yesterday. Wow, I swear to God. <laughs> so, I, I just landed from L.A. too. Like literally, was just out there doing Snoop Dogg's uh, uh, new sh new TV show that he does, and uh, and I just landed and. And uh, they told me you were on the radio, which I listen oh, to way, way in, in the morning anyway. Heather, what up? Yeah. You know? Heather on vacation, Preem. Hey, Preem. Oh, oh, Heather gets vacay. Yeah, oh, she gets vacay, man. That's how to be. <laughs> hey, Preem, let me ask you a question. Can you stay on the line? Because Adrian's going to play some of his beats. So I want you to hear them too, okay? <laughs> and, and then hey, we got... Hey, we got to hook up while you're out here, man. Oh, man. Okay, and we got Souls of Mischief in here too. But first, I'm going to take a couple of calls. Primo, stay on the line for me. All, All right, right. We'll do. We got Lamar on the line from Alabama. Good morning, Lamar. Good morning, Slay, man. I'm a big fan of this show. I'm a citizen. Okay, what's up, man? Hey, Adrian, man. I'm a, I'm a big fan of yours, man. I've been following your work. I just got done watching this movie you made the other day called Rick. Oh, that was a good movie, man. Thank you, brother. Thank you. I want to know one thing, though. Uh -huh. You got to make out with Beyonce Knowles. How is that? How is that? <laughs> man. I had to... I had to rehearse a lot you know we had to practice we had to do that scene a lot of times so i just want to make sure i got it right <laughs> <laughs> no it was it was amazing you know and um obviously she's 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 a knockout but she was so she was so dope she was so um uh, dedicated to yeah. her work and yeah. professional and um you know she was she was there crying i swear uh there's a scene in the movie that she sings for the last time and I and and I walk out the door and I know I'm not gonna see her again and my character's supposed to be choked up and I swear like I was choked up because I was like, I'm not gonna see Beyonce. Not, <laughs> she, I swear and, and no no disrespect anybody, but she was like, I was saying this woman is never gonna sing for me again. Like she's <laughs> singing for me and she's pouring her heart out there and Man, I cried. Yeah, so she's an amazing <laughs> artist, man. <laughs> no, don't go too deep with this. Jay Z okay, might sorry, be. That's what I'm saying. I'm sorry, I don't mean no, no disrespect, because I All love right. homeboy. But like, you know, that that was amazing. That was a that was a big that was a big gift to me. But thank you, bro. Thank yeah. you. And she did an excellent job as an actress. See, she it's was similar great. to you. You know, people just see her as a singer, but you know, she's a well-rounded artist. You know, people may uh, so she acts too, and then. People may just see you as an actor, but you were making beats before you really yeah. landed these major roles. Yeah. So here it is, man. Adrian Brody is here with us. Um, man, I want to hear this Sway beat. Okay, I'll play this shit. Yeah, this, these guys might want to get up on that, but this is just like some little just fun shit, just showing like some technology shit. Okay. I just made a little loop, but... Um, and DJ yeah. Premier is on the line with Primo, us as well. yeah, this is cool. Okay, okay. all right, let's hear this loop real go, quick. All right, we ready? Some, there's some shit yeah, for you, my man. Mr. 
Listen for passing around the headphones right now. Jay has the headphones now. Hope you'll just pass it to him. A plus. Okay, okay. A plus is on. A plus is on board. Let's give him some headphones. Festo, what do you think, man? Can you rock today? I can manipulate locks with my toes like Houdini. I'm rocking with the souls of mischief. Every flow is gifted. My homie Sway over there and Adrian Young. You know I'm sprung over the track. Don't get it mixed up with Adrian Brody. You know how we do. A character named Stoney. And the only, there is only now The album, go buy it, don't try it Rewind it, play it over and over again Fresh Rock is back You know my lens got three eyes Hieroglyphics the crew Blowing rappers up out of the scene You know how we do Chilling on the radio early morning style When I'm on the microphone my style is versatile Every verse is wild and out and wild and out And I got the third eye vision of precision Over the track is like a surgeon Rappers think I'm uh, submerging in the track But really I'm floating over the surface Fast rock is back, don't look so nervous huh, Boy I'm just like Purvis Ellison, never nervous Telling them when I spit a flow that's so eloquent The S-O-U L to the S, the boy name is Festo and every rhyme fresh yo And that's the west coast, back to the east coast, back to the east though You know how we go to H-I-E, R to the O And A plus is on my right, you know how it go If you wanna grab the microphone <laughs> Go on and on and on and on and on and on Adrian Brody yeah. beats I got more for you, I got more, let's what you get more Primo, you, you hear that Primo? Uh, you hear that, Prim? That's oh, funky right there. That's oh. like old brother '70s shit. Right. Okay. Yeah. Let's, let's play another one, man. All right. All right. All right. I'm gonna play you some. So, so what should I play? I'm gonna play you some. Uh, what number? He got. I'll over. play you. I'm gonna play you Doctor's Orders, man. That's some. That's some shit. Number one. I'll just play you some like. That's just some hip hop shit. This shit, actually, man. Wait, what it feel like to have Festo and Souls and Mr. Oh my Rock God, I'm, I'm, right I'm, there, man. I'm, I'm in heaven. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in heaven, freestyling on, <laughs> uh, on the air with my tracks. Like this is what it's about, anyway, man. I just. I want to share, share the, the vibe. Just like you want to share the vibe. I want to share the emotion in me, the fucking dope sounds and the crazy shit that I grew up around and how it mutates and comes out into some, some flow. And that's the same thing. Like, you know, it's, it's just. You're about to get work now. Heaven. There you go. All right, let's play this other beat, man. Uh, Adrian Brody on the piece. One of those Adrian Brody on the beats. Brody, beat, huh? Brody in the building. <laughs> what? what? You think, Ty J? You can jump uh, on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's some yeah, yeah. slap right there, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, though. You know what I'm saying, though. Okay. Oh, uh, you know it's like flows on my mind. I can't hold back. Now's the time. Every single rhyme, it always climbs to the pinnacle. Like King Kong, you know how it go. Extra special, the technique make you stretch to the sky. Hands up high, rhymes ain't surprising. Not when they dope coming from the soul. Come on, don't drop the soap, cause I'm fucking MCs. <laughs> you wack as fuck, start backing up. Niggas lacking what is necessary. And yes, it's very. So we effervesce and shine with rhymes. Each time I touch it, run up and crush it. You're out of luck, kid. You're fucked in a, 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 a myriad of ways. I'm eerie and I stay on the top when I rock, man. It's unbelievable how I kick a flow. The niggas can't get even to, yo. You can't even get into it, yo. It's invincible. It's 360 degrees circumference of rough shit. Bumping, stumping, jumping, pumping. All those verbs. We slay all you nerds, all you herbs and spices. Cause we the nicest, precisest. Hieroglyphics, we icing and acing. We like Horus and Isis and Thoth and all them dudes. Rap food, so kill the attitude and the bad moves. Man, you got some slap. <laughs> hey, 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 for real? Oh, man. I just realized I, I just I made the wrong career move. <laughs> this is what I should have been doing for the past 20 years, man. Yo, that's Holy great, shit. man. That was amazing. Adrian Brody, man. Um, Skills. We're going to take some calls, man. We're going to come wow. back. Oh, no, oh, Primo? Oh, Primo, oh. Primo, Primo. Yo, yo, yo. yo. yo tell them when, when, you know, you should have Adrian Brody come up on your show, Primo. 
Yeah, I'd love that. But, you know what I'm saying? Anytime, man. You know, I, I'm in town. I, I don't know how you're man, around. I'm bouncing it. today, but um, I'm, I'm, I'm back, man. End of Wait, the year, I'm back. Um, Wait, get, give him my number, we'll, 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 Adrian. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll have to link up and shit. All right, I okay. love that. I I'm love gonna that. pass on your number, the real one. I ain't gonna give him. Yeah, the f- we'll, we'll have to make. We'll have to do a, do a little production <laughs> right. thing or something. I don't All know. right, man, that'd be that'd Yo, be a shout, dream come true, homie. Shout, shout to Souls and Mr. the whole Hieroglyphics crew, Please. man. Those are my dudes. So, those are my dudes yeah, right man. there. Now, I don't know who sent me a box of y'all. I don't know who sent me a box of y'all shirts two years ago, but. I be rock. I, I still haven't rocked my green one yet because I'm saving that for a hot day to, to, to floss. But, <laughs> but uh, you know, I like the fact that y'all's movement has been still running after all these years. Y'all, y'all remind me of like the Gangstar logo. Y'all logo will never oh, ever man. die. Don't ever change it. Man. Right, man. Yo, thank man. You, man. Primo, that's, that's thank you, man, up. for calling in. It's my brother, Primo. I'm gonna give um, Adrian your information and then. All right. All right. Um, DJ Premier, man. Hey, man. Yo. Thanks for the love, Prem. Shout to Adrian Young too. Yo. For, for that new album yeah, that Yo, y'all Preen, what up? He Thank you, man. He oh. looking like Al Green today, Preen. Yeah. That's him, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Uh, man, Adrian, we going to come back? We got time? Oh, yeah, you got to do one more, dude. Right, cool. Okay, we'll I'll play some, some crazy shit. I mean, if we're going to flip yeah. it up, I'll play that. Oh, okay, we're going we to come back okay. with one more of Adrian and Brody's it. Beats and take your calls, 888-742-3345. <laughs> yeah, Sway in the Morning, Shade 45, Souls of Mischief are uh, hanging out with us. Adrian Brody is hanging out with us as well. Um, and he's playing some of his beats. And Souls of Mischief are spitting to it. They, they, you know, and, and they got their new project out too, right, Festo? Yeah, there is only now. Came out yesterday. It's mm-hmm. in stores now. Go get it. Produced by the, the world famous Adrian Young. Okay, and we got uh, mm-hmm. we got a couple callers on the line. Um, we got um, John in Vegas. Good morning, John. How you doing? I'm good. What's going on, fellas? Chilling, man. Say what, what up, up to Adrian Brody and Souls of Mischief. Hey, Adrian Brody, man. What's going on? Souls what up, John? Legendary. That's hey. that dope, man. Thank you, B. What do you think of yeah, his beats? Hey. Yo, straight up, I didn't even know he was a hip hop head like that. So like, <laughs> when I heard him up there, and he was like, "Yeah, Adrian Brody's bringing beats." I was like, "Ah, oh, here we go, another actor trying to get into the rap game." But oh. Nah, hey, you're certified, man. Those beats, those beats are legit, man. Thank you, bro. Thank you. All right. Um, who was that that started rapping? Joaquin Phoenix or something? Oh man, and I got the beard too right now. Yeah, that would have yeah, yeah, yeah. been funny. You'd have been like, "Oh, well, was he serious with that?" Doesn't I don't he? think so. I, c- I couldn't imagine that, man. But. <laughs> Yeah. That shit was funny though. Come on, yeah, it was I, I would have. I, I mean, that was funny. I kind of like it, even if it was serious. Yeah. Just but because he he it couldn't have been. But like yeah. that shit, like him falling off the of stages and like being drunk. And wow, like just shit. and and whack boy. freestyling and just <laughs> like he boo booed on his homeboy. He shit on his homeboy. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Damn. Damn. <laughs> Defecated I on the that homie? Part. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Drop the hot one. Yeah, uh, Teddy. Yeah. Drop it like it's hot. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, we got oh, Teddy from Philly on the line. Teddy, go uh, ahead, man. What you want to say? Yo, what up, everybody? Yo, um, first of all, respect the souls of Mr. Yo, Adrian, you're, uh, you're a great actor, Mr. A-list. But, uh, yo, what about me getting on those beats? Let's, let's make a mixtape, man. Uh, okay. You got you got to <laughs> You gotta get up here. We got some dope MCs in the house right now, though. We gotta, gotta yeah, get I know, you in there. I know. <laughs> yeah, see, Adrian ain't got nothing to prove now. You gotta prove yourself. Uh, right. Adrian, Adrian's like, yeah, kid, you can't be whack on my beats. <laughs> <laughs> Ray, Ray and Callie, what you wanna yeah. say? What's up? What's up, man? What's up, Adrian? What up? I'm a big fan, man. I love Thank all, you. Your, all your shit, man. I'm a big movie buff, man. Cool. I love from the pianist all the way to a king, even King Kong, man. That shit was tight. Thank you. And I'm loving the beats too, man. They're official. Thank you, brother. Thanks yeah, a lot. And there's, this is an audience that'll tell you the truth, man. In fact, they would love to tell you the truth if, the, if they weren't feeling the beats. Right. Um, so this is this is good to hear. You guys, Souls and Mischief, y'all have a show coming yeah. up. Talk about when, when is the show? I, <laughs> yeah, LPR. Uh, At the LPR uh, tomorrow evening. It's gonna be dope, man. We got. Uh, Ali Shaheed Muhammad coming through, uh, Adrian Young with a full live band, uh, Venice Dawn, for all the people out there that have been following Adrian Young and, you know, all those those beats that Timberland and everyone is sampling, you know, Adrian is there with his band that they sample those those beats from, you know what I mean? Wow. So we're going to be up there with Souls of Mischief. It's going to be 
It's going to be a live night, man. I'm really looking forward to it. I'm excited. Where, where is that at? Anybody know? Like uh, the LPR, La Poisson Rouge. Uh, La Poisson uh, Rouge? Uh, uh, I'm to speak French, man. Bonjour, <laughs> monsieur. I'm NYU, uh, man. Bitch. West Village. <laughs> that, just, that just sounds fly. You should just say that everywhere. That's All right. Uh, Tracy? Yeah, Adrian, since yeah. so clearly you have a passion for, um, for hip-hop and it's a part of your fabric, would you ever consider taking a hardcore break from acting if you could do this on a full-time level? Oh, I've... I've contemplated that many times. I yeah. mean, really, um, I still feel like I got, I have to do one cohesive album, whether it's, you know, even I, even just to do like some shit with like, um, mostly like instrumental stuff with some, with some heads that I know that I like that, mm -hmm. you know, that could be cool. But I, I do want to do something. Uh, I just have... Uh, I've got five movies. I did five movies between January and by the time I finish this movie, I'm going to do at the end of the year, I'll have five, I've done five movies and I've never done that. But like, I'm, I'm, my day job is, um, I love it and I'm really passionate about it and it's all, it, it's fully, full immersion. Mm -hmm. And, um, it's funny. I used to make like most of my tracks I made when I wasn't working so that I was doing something creative and not you know, fucking around and, and, um, and I just have, I'm, I feel blessed that I'm working, but I have to, t I have to consciously say I'm going to take a break. And that, that may be soon because, you know, I got to keep it fresh for myself anyway. And, um, you know, I got a, I got a, a really, uh, I got a friend of mine who's a mu uh, musician, magician, musician mm -hmm. in, uh, in Paris, whose name is, uh, Philippe Cohen Solal. Mm -hmm. He did, uh, Go Go Tan Project. Uh -huh. He's so dope. He like brought this like kind of hip hop vibe with tango and like, all this ill shit. So we've been working on a couple tracks, but um, I'd like to be like, you know, in the cut in New York for a while and just lay some shit down and surprise people. That'd be great. Well, man, you got you got souls of mischief rapping over your beats. First time out, man, and you went straight That's... to the top with that, <laughs> right, there, right? Right? You know, you got these dudes spinning. Listen, we, I want to play. Yeah, let's, try, let's play okay, something good. else, man. Okay. Let's see if some. So, what, what are we gonna play? Some like freaky shit? We wanna play some like freaky? music shit? Yeah, I mean, I got, you Tracy freaky likes freaky. Shit? I Tracy likes freaky. It's kind of it's kind of like gangster freaky. Like I just played some hard shit because I think like the misconception is like, you know, pianist. Like, how do you make you make beats? Like it's so. Do you I actually shut play them the down. piano? I, I, you know, it's cool. Uh, I don't read music, mm -hmm. but I'm, I'm, I'm musical and I can I got a good ear and that's how I've always made music but then I had to learn how to play a good portion of Chopin's Nocturne and Nocturne Posthumous and the Ballad which is all this really dope melancholy dissonant sounds and um, it it schooled me a bit because it's all muscle memory it's like you know yeah. I, I can play that shit now and I don't know what I'm playing yeah and um, <laughs> but I, <laughs> but I know when it's right and I yeah. know when it feels right yeah. and and like all I I always incorporated this kind of morbid kind of stuff in my tracks like real mob deep kind of yeah you know tragic storytelling shit like uh -huh. that's what I like like the shit I was gonna play you is this shit called pillage which is like straight up like some pillaging going on on the on your eardrums. All so. right, these are beats by Adrian Brody. <laughs> Let's see what this sound like. Souls of Mischief in here too. If they feel it, they'll jump on it. I just saw Opio grab the headphones. I still did too. Some opium war shit. There it is. Mm. Check check one two. Yeah. Haha. <laughs> This ain't the summer of Sam, no gun in my hand Shit is hot, you should run to the fan Uh, my name is Opio, rock with my man Fast rock, and that's how we stand Uh, strong like the pyramid You ain't hearing it I grab the mic, yo, I straight start steering shit I'm from Oakland, tires be smoking Sideways through the streets, I ain't joking Uh, T-Mask got the ski mask We run up on niggas and then we blast <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what time it is. I grab the mic, yo, I'm rhyming like the Wiz. Michael Jackson doing the backspin for niggas out there that need to be relaxing. Don't ask no questions when I'm resting. I rock mics just like I blast the Smith and Wesson. On them seas to they temple. This ain't simple. Yo, change the tempo. Make it faster. That's how I rock where the grass goes greener. Yeah, I stay meaner. Uh, 
What it do out there? Opio Lindsay, yeah, I still got long hair. Looking like I'm 21, but I'm 40. Yeah, still start <laughs> macking on your shorty. Oh. Huh. Yeah, and I don't be snorting. No type of powder. I just got power. Mind power, all in the brain. Straight to the membrane. Niggas is lame. What up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Let's play another beat. Let's play another beat. All right, play that. So, play, ladies and gents, let's play ladies some and ladies and gents. gents. Let's see if we get up? another one off. Hold up, hold up. Right. Adrian Brody is in what here up? playing beats. Make it loud, baby. Make it loud. Adrian Brody, Sway in the Morning, Shay 4-5, Souls of Mischief in there. <laughs> And you say these are like eight years old? At least. Maybe ten. My, yo, I played this shit of my intro going on. Orlando Jones is my boy. He had a show, and yeah. like I was his guest on the show. And they played this shit for me coming out. So that was at least ten years ago. That's eight years, years ago, ago, right? Wow. That's crazy, because that show was about, yeah, you're right. right? Was, yeah. So that I played that, and that was old then. All right, let's play, <laughs> let's play number three, Shimmy. Beats by Adrian Brody. We're gonna play Aloha beat. What's this one about? Man? Did you make it in Hawaii? Yeah, I made that shit in Hawaii. Oh, okay. <laughs> Aloha. All right. I was looking at a whale. <laughs> <laughs> Official, right? Yeah. We, we give him a thumbs up, right? Thank you. Yeah, you, you, you're official. Adrian Brody, man. Thank you, dude. Listen, um, you want to hear one real quick one off this shit for, yeah. for the ladies? Like, this shit is just like Ow. a little okay. love song. I think this is it. Let me just, hopefully this is it. But, um, nah, man, this is a, this is a real treat, man. I right. mean, it's just, you know, it's, it's, mm. We getting caught up in that right yeah. there. <laughs> Yo, we talking that's Adrian Brody. You do you doing what the up, drops man. live on the air, that right? Shit right yeah, here, I like that, man. Uh, there it is. Sway oh, in the morning, shade yeah. four or five, man. Where else you gonna find this? Adrian Brody dropping beats on you fools. Ooh. All right, make Ooh. sure you watch Houdini 2 September 1st on the History Channel. It's a mini series, two part mini series. And then there is only now, man, available right now. That's an album by Souls of Mischief. Pick it up now on iTunes and check them out tomorrow at LPR. Tomorrow night with Adrian Young. It's going to be an incredible show. I'm going. I'm in there. Yeah. Uh, you yeah. got to leave in town today, though, right, Adrian? I'm leaving town, yeah. Okay, man. I, I hey. stayed for this. Word? Stay, word up. Yeah. You have to be That's scheduled. I stayed for you, man. Hey, for real. Man, I appreciate That's that, later. man. Thank you, man. man. Thank you, man. It's good to have you here, Thank too, you. man. You come back anytime. We do on Fridays, we do Friday ciphers. Well, we had Hit Boy, um, Mike Will made it, Amadeus, Diamond D. Oh, Diamond uh, we've had D. A, we, oh yeah, God. right? I'm we had, here. We had a lot of legendary I'm producers come up on Fridays, mm -hmm. and they play beats for MCs. That so beats. next time you're in New York, bring some beats with you, all right? I will. I'm going right. to have to get to work now. I'll play okay. you some new shit, yeah. Okay, there it is. Adrian okay. Brody, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Also, uh, we want to thank our guests that came by today. K. Flay for coming by. Stiley from MMG. Um, look for his new album, Ohio, coming out October 28th. Uh, uh, Jack and Chevy's is his new single and video. <laughs> uh, so make you make sure you look out for that. Mike Muse for coming in doing the political news. Our guest mixer, the legendary Easy Mo B for coming in, getting on those turntables today. Uh, of course, Souls of Mischief. This, this is family, man. It's always good to see you guys. What's up, Sway? Yeah, there's only love, now. Thank you, as always, man, oh, for everything. Man, y'all ain't got to thank me. It's all love, man. It's family. But I appreciate that. And they got you <laughs> fucked up, man. <laughs> you, you know what I'm You know, Sway. Still right, got, got the motherfucking answer. Right? Oh, there it is. Oh, <laughs> there you tell them all. Hey, <laughs> when, when is the next high roll day? Monday. Monday. Yeah, Monday, September first. Yeah. We expecting. You know, it's gonna be. It's gonna be crazy, man. Damn, damn. Red eye. I ain't gonna be in. Red eye flight. <laughs> <laughs> damn. Book it now. <laughs>
We trying to get that lover to come down, you know? Last year I was hosting that. They got an Oakland declared, you know, it's a September 1st, right? That's High Road Day. Uh, We're we're all from Oakland. So uh, last year I had a chance to host it. And, you know, we all, you know, I watched these dudes come up. Um, and so it's always an honor to fly home to do that. But I don't know if I'm gonna be able to make it this weekend. Damn, damn, damn. But what about the doc? It's you know what? It's been at a bunch of uh festivals. We've been winning a bunch of festivals and everything. Yeah. Really honestly, man, and this is for the listeners and everything, how you put out a music movie right now. You know, because it's not mm-hmm. something that people necessarily go to the theaters to see. Yeah. And don't nobody really buy DVDs. Do you put it on Netflix? Do you red box it? You know, that's a that's kind of a um Dilemma a dilemma that we yeah. have. We think about maybe doing a whole 93 Till live album and packaging it together. Well, or Adrian Brody is right here. He could probably answer that question. <laughs> <laughs> what would you suggest? I'm going to school you to the new shit. Right? Hey. Yeah. 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 Let those they, producers be pulling behind their sleeves, you know? Yeah. What yeah they got magic tricks. That's the problem. Mm. They got the magic tricks. But, yeah. Um, hey, man. It's it's a streaming kind of world, so you okay. got to, like, tap into that. You should, we, You know. I have some projects that I've been working on my own too, independently, and, and like, um, it's a dilemma. So you got to find the thing that that um, uh, reaches the audience, and I think you got to understand that if people uh, people want to see that, they want to download that, they want yeah. they want content. So, um, but I, I like the idea of you're gonna mix it with uh, you know um, an album as a as a as a, as a like a, a virtual component to come with the music, which is really dope. Um, uh, but again, then you, you know, that's still going to be, uh, something downloadable. So you should find, um, you should talk to, you should talk to iTunes maybe and see if they could like mm. sell it as a, as a, as a movie. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, good time. Game. Game. <laughs> Light bulb. The producer. <laughs> um, I, put, I, I put the P in producing. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Everybody went, damn, yeah. why do we, uh, iTunes? Uh, it's true. Oh, the place we've been selling all everything else that we have. Okay, right. yeah. yeah. How about that? Yeah. That's how Beyonce did it? Yeah. 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 Um, what well, you've been drinking. There you go, Beyonce. <laughs> Beyonce spoken like Herself a true Beyonce. Out. Yeah, I mean, That's she right. had the visual. She did that, right. All right, Tracy G, how can you be reached on Twitter, or Instagram, or otherwise? Go ahead. Yep, at it's Tracy G, I T S T R A C Y G. What about souls? How can people, if they want to reach out directly or just through one platform, how can they reach y'all, man? Twitter is at S O M Hyro. I shouldn't even say Facebook. It's a play on words. <laughs> yeah. Saul Mischievitz on, uh, on Facebook and um, Souls of Mischief on Facebook. Um, Instagram. Okay, what about you, Adrian? My man, I, yo, so check this. I never do any social media, uh-huh. and yesterday I just broke down and I, I set up um, an Instagram account, at Adrian Brody. Wow. And so I'm, I pushed the, the faker off, whoever the fake at Adrian Brody was, yeah. and I'm, now I'm that. I'm, and there's no pictures yet, so it's coming. Maybe even tonight. Hey, dude, let's be the let's be your first picture uh-huh. right here with oh, souls. Oh, that'd be that's yeah. what's up. Let's yeah. do that. You, I'm, I would like be that. Your first picture, that man. would be dope. Let's yeah, do that. We're gonna do that right I'll, now. I'll put that shit on there. Yeah, today. I'm at real sway. That's what's up. I'm at real sway at Twitter and Instagram, and then you'll be able to um, see souls of mischief and Adrian on Sway's Universe on our YouTube channel and on the website. Uh, we'll turn this over by tonight today. All right, so you can hear the beats firsthand and and, and, and see the truth and what all of these artists do. It's Sway in the morning. Only on Shade 45.